Okay, we're going to do a quick tutorial on how to transfer your user created templates of your titles. Um, a lot of people forget that uh, you can save your user titles um, or your user templates. And when you transfer over from CS5 to CS5.5, uh, they don't automatically transfer over. So you're going to have to do them manually. It's really easy to do. Uh, let me show you. I'm going to First, I have open uh, CS 5.5 and people forget that you have to uh, transfer the stuff over. So this is really easy to do. Let's go over and check it out. First, you're going to want to go over to where your title is. You can either go file new uh, title or you can go to new title over here and just go based on template. Either one will work. So I'm just going to go here because I already showed you how to get to the other one and we're going to go here. I actually brought in some templates already uh, that worked pretty well. So let's add some more and uh, get this thing started. So here we go. There's a little button over here. It looks like a play button. You want to click on that and it's going to say give you a drop down list. It's going to say import file as template. That's exactly the one we're going to want to do. So we click on that. And the thing is, is you're going to have to find where your old files are located. I'm going to make that really easy for you because in the show notes, I'm going to show you exactly uh, where the directory is. Uh, so you do, the easiest way for me to show you is just go to your OS drive first, then scroll down to where it says users. Click on that. Now click on your user. My, everybody's user is going to be different. That's why I didn't want to show you the exact location. So it's really easy to do. I'm going to show you how to copy and paste it. Just click on your user. And now this is the kicker. This is the actual destination of where those documents are or templates. You're going to go up to the top here at the uh, Windows browser. Now when you click once, on Windows 7, if you're using Windows 7, you're going to see that uh, it has the C, uh, C drive, users, uh, forward slash, all that fancy stuff. What you're going to do is just copy and paste what I have in the show notes right after where it has the users and then your name or whatever your name is on your computer. Paste and that's it. And then hit enter. And there it is. It's that simple. Um, there's other ways to do it too. You can actually go up to the search templates and put in .prtl and that's the exact file extension name and you can hit enter and it'll search and you can save it that way as well. Um, it's really easy to do. Um, it's good. It's a necessity to have these templates because you're going to have a bunch of clients with phone numbers or whatever you're editing you're not going to want to redo all these templates um, and these in CS5 to CS5.5 it integrates seamlessly. So let's just click one. We'll do a cell number. Hit open. Uh, you can rename it if you want. I'm just going to hit cell number two because I already have that in and hit OK and there it is. So you double click on that and it saved your whole entire uh, information and everything. So it works really easy. I hope it helps out. These are one of those tricks that you just kind of forget about when you upgrade, but it it's one of those necessities. You don't want to have to redo all your titles. So I'm going to add some more tutorials on uh, transferring stuff over. So uh, check out my page on uh, YouTube. It's uh, what exit video. Thanks.